Hi everyone and welcome back to Queen G's Recipes and today we will be making a raspberry clafouti. Now raspberry clafouti is a French baked dessert which is almost like a custardy pancake. It's baked, it's wonderful, it is just delicious, full of flavor and it's so easy to put together. Now traditionally a clafouti is made with black cherries but today we will be making it with raspberries because I found some at my local grocery store and they were nice and fresh and I thought we would try something different. So the ingredients we'll be needing here are a mixture of heavy cream and milk, of course some raspberries, you want to make sure that they have been rinsed and dried, some eggs, melted butter, some flour, some salt and some sugar. Now for the extracts I'll be adding in some vanilla extract and a little bit of lemon extract which is optional if you don't have any of the lemon on hand you don't have to purposely go buy it. Um, you could also add in some lemon zest if you wanted I will leave that up to you. So you also want to have your oven preheating to 400 degrees Fahrenheit and I also have an 8 by 11 baking dish which I have greased with some butter and um, that's about it. You can also use a springform pan if you wanted. You could use whatever you have on hand or whatever you prefer as long as you grease it with some butter. Okay, so let's move on to making our raspberry clafouti. Okay, so the first thing I like to do is place my raspberries in my already greased pan here. Now you can also use a glass pie dish, like a nine and a half inch glass pie dish. I have done it in there before and it works out well as well. So that is up to you. And now we are just going to place our raspberries on the bottom of our dish here. Okay, so this looks good. Now I'm going to set this aside and we are going to work on our filling. Okay, so into a nice clean bowl, we're going to add in our eggs and we will also add in our sugar and we're going to whisk these ingredients probably for about a minute. And now we are ready to add in all of our remaining ingredients except for our flour and salt. Now just be careful when adding in your lemon extract because extracts are very potent so if you add in too much it will definitely give you too much of that strong flavor. So as I mentioned it's optional but if you do make sure you actually use a um, teaspoon uh, measurement to uh, measure the one quarter teaspoon of uh, lemon extract. Now we are definitely ready to add in our last two ingredients, our flour and our salt and we are going to give this a good mix until you notice that there are no longer any flour little bumps or anything visible and your custard mixture is uh, lump free and is nice and smooth. Okay, so now I'm gonna bake my raspberry clafouti at 400 degrees Fahrenheit for about 35 to 40 minutes. Or when you notice that the um, custard is set, I will let you know how long mine was in the oven for and what it looks like when it's done. Okay, so my raspberry clafouti was in the oven for exactly 35 minutes. If you are uncertain if it's baked, you can always insert a toothpick into the center and if it comes out clean, then you know it is completely baked. So it definitely puffs up as it's baking. That is very normal, but it will start to deflate as well as it cools off. So I'm going to allow it to come to a warm uh, room temperature and um, then I will show you how I uh, like to serve it. And and most definitely you can eat this warm, you can eat it cold out of the fridge, you can have it any way you like, um, but most definitely allow it to come to temperature before placing it in the fridge after. So that's what I like to do, that's what I suggest, and now I'm going to leave it on my counter until it comes to the right temperature that I like to serve it, and then we'll dust it with some icing sugar and we will be ready to try it. Okay, so my raspberry clafouti has been sitting here at room temperature for about 30 minutes or so, and now I have already dusted it with some icing sugar. I'm going to add a little bit more.
Okay, that's great. And now we are going to cut a slice here. It is so delicious. It is like a custard pancake. That's all I can explain it. That's the only way I can explain it, actually. It is so delicious, and it's very important to add that extra generous sprinkling of icing sugar or powdered sugar because it adds a little bit of sweetness because this isn't a very sweet dessert. So um, that's important, and most definitely, I will suggest this recipe to anyone it is awesome, it is amazing, it is wonderful. It is so, so delicious. You can serve it hot or cold, it is custardy, it is just perfection, and I really hope you guys give this one a try. And that's about it. I'm gonna continue on eating my slice of raspberry clafouti, and um, I will leave you the full recipe in the description box as always, and uh, I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. So if you enjoyed the video, don't forget to give us a nice big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already, and hit the notification bell so you will be notified every time I upload a new and delicious recipe. Share the recipe with your family and friends, and I'll see you in my next video. Take care. Bye, everyone.